and welcome back folks to the next next part of this co-op let's play as always i'm the blood claw and this is Raj, you traitorous bastard if you accept that <laughs> i wasn't gonna be fighting the man away I think they know me too well. But then again, maybe they don't know me at all because I wasn't planning to invade them. So that's 3,000 they could have used for trying to attack you and retake their land. Hmm. So in a way, I am As I said, you. I'm making them poorer. <laughs> As I said before, you traitorous bastard. I was just trying to help. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> That's a nice excuse though, I was taking their money. <laughs> oh, oh. The oh, this is just... Only the weak seek the Benedians now, offering me money. <laughs> That's 4k I've made from... Just people wanting peace with me this turn. <laughs> Who else are you at war with? This is a profitable thing. <laughs> uh, the Western Romans, the Langobards, the... Oh, oh, uh, actually I might have to fight this... Yeah, I might have to fight this battle out. It's Who's halfway and I don't want to lose it. Uh, the, um, the rebels. Okay. On one of my territories. Yeah, I'm gonna have to fight this. It's a halfway mark and I don't want to lose it. Ah, uh, yeah, it's one of those better safe than sorry moments. Yeah. But it'll be a quick one. Yeah, it should be simple enough. Mercenary Desert Bowman. I was going to say, what type of archers are they you've got? But... Seize on the battlefield. And welcome, folks. The battle's just started. And your general, that was the shortest speech I've ever heard. I made it one <laughs> word capital. Apparently those catapults can't aim. They got four men. I guess they deserve a medal. <laughs> well, they are half a mile away, trying to hit a pretty small target. There's, the Marines are pretty cool. The Marauder Marines. The picture is really nice. You. Oh, desert. That's why they sound like they're making some sort of Zulu noise. I was like, why is Legionaries making a Zulu type noise? And they're firing artillery while the guys are fighting it out. Good job, guys. I guess they want to kill their own guys. I think they just did kill more of their men than yours in that last volley. Looks like you just saved that tower and no more. <laughs> oh. Spoke too soon. D 
these bows have long range though. Let's see how these guys like it in the back. Point blank range. I find it weird they're still hacking their shots. Oh, where did the cavalry come from? They were retreating earlier. I was hoping they'd continue running. It doesn't matter, they're mercenary, so... The more of them die, the less you have to pay. Doesn't really work like that in the <laughs> game, but in real life it would. That's why I usually use mercenaries as cannon fodder all the time. Uh oh, here comes trouble. The Onaga crew. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> they look so eager too. I'm just zooming in on them. They're like cheering and going, yay! Yeah, they're eager and everything. Uh, these guys don't even have shoes. <laughs> I just hear them scream and give them steel. Ugh. Ugh. They're winded. And I like how my army retreats through the two armies fighting each other. Yeah, that's, that's very smart, guys. Be careful, your general's on his own versus the Onaga crew. <laughs> Just you wait, our general has fallen. <laughs> My entire army cracks. I bet you that has happened to someone. Just like the general somehow dies, so like an Onaga crew. The whole unit has been destroyed. Yeah, good job guys. You just decide to go through a uh, army that's fighting. Whoa! Did you just see that? The entire what? defector army just went from looking straight to a full swing 180 degrees. I was zoomed out there trying to get a larger picture. Yeah, they were like, alright, we got the five. Hey, we got enemies! 180. I've seen pikemen do stuff like that though, just before I charged, and I was like, what the hell? <laughs> Especially in the old Rome when I was fighting Makadon, for some reason their pikemen would just spear up, turn round, spear down. It's like, oh, for fudge's sake. <laughs> spear up? Oh, look, they're coming behind us. All the spears just like turn into this conglomerate mass in all directions. And I'm like, what? A seven minute battle. Look. And we're back. Hey, how it doesn't sort my camera and go after the battles sometimes. <laughs> there we go. I think that's right. No, it still doesn't look right. You traitor. <laughs> <laughs> I think you just remembered. <laughs> How could you use something like that, man? As I said, I was taking money off them so they'd have less to attack you with. I did it in your interests. Uh -huh. uh, protect it. This turn I'll just see if they want to trade too. <laughs> and occupy. Man, they have sheep pens, you get a lot of money from those. What the hell? Ready for battle. 
Oh man, now I have to. Ah. Uh... Uh... Siege. I can't move. I'm under siege at Constantinople. By who? I'm not even gonna try and pronounce uh... it. <laughs> God, <you mean> <laughs> <laughs> the Grithundians. The Grithundians. Okay. <laughs> oh, those are these guys right here. <laughs> well, at least you got a war with somebody that actually doesn't like you. That's surprising. Usually everyone's friendly with you. Dun dun dun. Uh, even the picks are out in like force out here. They only had. Uh... Uh, I don't understand. <laughs> Darn, I wasn't fast enough to take the territory. Take what one? The Ajax territory. They rebuilt everything pretty well, and now I'm technically trapped on this island. <laughs> I can't move anywhere, because they have a navy sitting out there that's really strong. You could nip down and go for Karaha. Corrales I first. can't. The, uh, the zone of control. Oh, you're stuck in it. Yep, I can't even leave because there's a huge fleet sitting outside the walls. Apparently these guys don't like you because they have minus 50 because I have trade past treaties with you. Who? With the uh, Gathernians, the uh, ones that have the, uh, I don't know. I, yeah, I, I don't know. I could move this army up to help you take Ajax. Uh. I think it would be easier if I just got a navy, because they have, if you see right off the side is a navy, you go onto the water, they will destroy you. If I moved up, I could probably force march over the water in one turn, if I moved from Rome. And I mean the city mm. I've got called Rome, not its mine now. Yeah. Yeah, Rome, and yeah, you could do that, but uh, as I said, um, yeah, you yeah, we could do a join op real quick, if anything. But, um, for now, I think you might want to just have, uh... Yeah, that could work. Yeah, that'd be good. Alright, let me see what I want to do now. Uh, the Franks are at war with your union and stuff like that. Oh man, it's gonna take forever before these settlements actually get rebuilt. Converted or... Yeah, converted. And slash rebuilt. It's like 11 turns normally, isn't it? Yeah. Well, at least the land is fertile. Oh yeah, I forgot. Military. On Need Constantinople, it. I think I misclicked, because I'm just noticed I'm tearing the aqueduct down, but not the church. And there's nothing I can do about it now. Actually, I would love to see if they attack you and what a battle would look like in Constantinople Barbarianized. But unfortunately, it's not. I've not converted it yet. Yeah, <laughs> I would love to see some of Barbarianized. I wonder if it'd just go to a generic map or it'd still be the unique map for Constantinople. It's the unique map. They always keep those are the certain Terra Ravana, Rome, uh Sestapon, Constantinople and a few others are unique. They don't change whatsoever. 
so it would just be barbarian. The rest effect. are generic. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But we'll see. I don't know. I've never seen it. If it actually would be barbarian or fied. Well, that's why I thought it might change to generic, generic map instead. Yeah. Uh, actually, what's going on here? Buildings plus six. Mm. Uh, I have a huge food shortage in this territory. Wow. I didn't even notice. I have minus 90 in this town. Yeah, I've got a few places I could probably be better with food. anything else at this moment in time you know what should I do that or should I just read uh, how much would I get well an of 4,000 yeah that, that, that sounds good yeah I'll raid <laughs> extra 400 bucks always good the Roman Emperor is now a admiral yeah well, he was a governor, a governor, an army dude, and then now an admiral. What will he become next? Send in the troops. I feel evil for a moment. Oh, for the taxes? Jeez. Yes. Ish. I feel like being an evil dictator. Passions for weaklings. <laughs> oh, wait, no, Warlord. I've got two guys called Alaric. I've got three guys called Alaric. Yep, just three. Saved by the besieging. It didn't pull the aqueduct down yet. Nice. Kind of burning everything out the spur of the moment. <laughs> Mercenary Agrathasi warriors. Never seen them before. I'm not trying to retreat, I'm just trying to... Why is my navy not getting any action? How can I help? Father be praised! How can I help? But now they run away. Oh, I was hoping to get that battle in. Alright, sorry about that. What's up? Nah, uh, someone else is trying to call me. Oh, okay. I was hoping I'd get the battle there, because I was going to attack out of Constantinople, but they decided to run. <laughs> Ready for battle. Cowards. Ready for battle. Right, let's see. Um, 
shimmy on up to Rome, then next turn I'll shimmy on over to Ajax. You know what, I could even... How much range does that navy have? You have to land oh, right here. Big. Yeah, you saw that <laughs> size. That, that's an actual... It has advanced ships. The level 2 ships. They ain't like little dinghy ships. Yeah, and they that's... have like four... Yeah, and they have four artillery uh, platforms. I'm not moving any further than that, because otherwise they'll be able to chase me uh, down if they decide to. It, actually, they could get you if they want. They, you're just in their range. Right, I'm moving to the city then. <laughs> yeah, they, I lo I'm looking at them right now. They just can reach you. They can just reach the city. Better safe than sorry. Yeah, the last thing you want is your fleet sunk. Yeah, I keep forgetting. Man, I could be getting more money, but I keep forgetting to get rid of some mercenaries. a hard choice because I want religion but my religion buildings are pretty poo poo. <laughs> I'll just do what I always do, go for a chief and sold. Money, public order, what more can I ask? I'm actually quite grateful that that faction besieged me now because it saved my aqueduct. Today I've just been constant misclicking and tongue tied. And me, I'm at war. Literally, everyone's declaring war and trying to take my territory, those bastards. It's all mine. Mine, I tell you. Let's see. Yeah. Who else is at war with you that might want to have peace with me? Do not attempt <laughs> to sweeten truth, Connie. No Batia. I am here then. Ah, they're a client state, so. Come, come. Let Custom. me hear your it's talk. Royal household. You have the ear of my people. Oh, none of the other people want to have peace with me. Good. <laughs> There's no one new to trade with either. I just remembered, I'm not at war with the Romans. So, I think I could yeah. be a wee bit... I doubt they'll you declare war You could actually go out. Huh? I doubt they'll declare war on me, so I'm gonna be gutsy. On the move, lads. <laughs> just to make sure I've got plenty of range when I leave Force March. Or whatever it's called for when ah. double time. Okay. Apart from that. Vienna. In turn. Alright, I shall return in a moment. Quiet. Too quiet. The spy is just taunting me. As always.
These interns seem to be getting longer, not shorter. Separatists. Separatists. What are you up to? Must be up to something. They're probably talking to Rise. It's snowing. I can hear the birdies. Sorry about that. That's no problem. Take it the separatists are talking to you. Yep. Alright. I'm good. Finally ended. The Roman Navy is gone. So you don't even need it, my army now. Happy face. Well, the bubonic plague broke out. Was it this part or last part we had a battle? Uh, this part for the, against the um the rebels. I guess this is the second time in a row we've made one that's about fifty minutes long. So I think after your turn we'll cut it apart. No, it's been about 30 minutes. Is it? Okay. Yeah, like 10.30 was the last time you stopped and I was looking on my time. It's a little bit past, so I would say about close to 40 maybe. Okay. Just because I know this clip that I've been recording is 20 minutes long and we had the battle, so I just assumed it'd be longer. Because the battles are normally about 10 yeah, minutes. It's about, yeah, it was about 7 minute battle. Here come the Franks. Oh, the Rugians went and brought their pals. Looks like they're gonna try and get me one and a half stacks. Huh. For the tribe! And what the hell? The Gurhundians, or however you pronounce it, are right back at Carthage, despite them running away. <laughs> Father be praised! How can I help? I would be glad if someone just won in and just burned the settlement to the ground. Burned what one? The Palma, even though I won't get the, um... Oh, let me see if they tore it down. Nope, they're still keeping it. Huh. <laughs> Looks like they're doing sun to the church, though. Yeah, they're probably replacing it with theirs. Weird how you can convert a like really very large church building, but not a farm. <laughs> the farm be so complicated. 
Yes, it is. It's gonna be a while before I can build more industry. Oh. And. City development. Nah. Now I'm just trying to figure out what I want to do with my money. I know what I want to do with Maine, but I know what I'm gonna force myself not to do with Maine. Get heavy cavalry <laughs> tactics. I keep telling myself soon, soon, when I don't have as much to spend on the campaign map. But I want it. Oh, I can't even get it yet. Oh, phew, that'll stop me getting it. It'll be 20 turns before I can get it. Alright, finally building a city in one of my settlements. I think I'm going to go straight for Visigothic martial culture now. It'll take 51 turns, but... Yeah. Yeah, well, by the time it happens, we'll probably have the game end. <laughs> Don't rub it in. We might get there. Might. It. Yeah, uh-huh. I want those free snow sworn. So that's done. Ah, nice. Stop the unhappiness for a little while. Hmm. Alright, so I got that. I got 3k still in the bank. And. All right. It's probably awkward seeing this like aqueduct network in the middle of a barbarian encampment city or something. It's like, huh? <laughs> it's like it's like you have buildings made out of straw and stone out of a huge entire building that's probably made out of marble and all other expensive stuff. Ooh. Oh yeah, ten thousand per turn. I am so happy now. Actually, if I eliminate my fleet, I'd probably get more. Yeah. Still there. Hmm? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, I was just taking everything in. For a moment. Yeah, for a moment I thought you, uh, you had a crash or something again. No, it was one of those moments where it felt like I was talking back, but I wasn't. You know what I mean? Just sitting, taking everything in. Ah. Uh. Alright, I am ending it here. You can take your turn. I think I'll just cut apart oh, there. One sec. Yeah. Bloop. Political favors. Political favors. Political favors. Oh, so many things to click. It's because I just re gave everyone their seats again. But anyway, hope everyone's enjoyed this. And see you all next time.